hello viewers welcome to my channel and today's topic is uh, mohs surgery uh, but before starting the topic i would like to request you to subscribe this channel for more informative videos every day now mohs surgery uh, which is also referred to mohs microscopic surgery and, uh, and also known as mms it is a special technique that uh, visualizes uh, both pathology and the surgery to remove the skin cancers in the physician's office, you know. It's a very precise procedure and uh, it's a highly detailed method where the horizontal pieces of the tissue are cut from the bottom most layer of the skin, you know, and immediately stained and examined under the microscope. And uh, repeated uh, uh, like saucer shape layers of uh, tissues are removed and examined until no more skin cancer is left behind you know. Now the procedure uses frozen sections of the skin that are then stained uh, uh, with the special dyes and the dyed frozen pieces of the skin are examined under microscope and tumor map showing the sites of any residual cancer cells is drawn uh, by most surgeon you know. Now the process permits an uh, uh, examination of the entire tumor's uh, margins uh, simultaneously uh, while the patient is waiting you know and if uh, more cancer cells are seen under the microscope tissue is removed at the site of the involvement you know and each skin layer uh, that is removed is called the level and uh, if no more cancer cells are seen at a particular level um, and then it is uh, deemed clear uh, which means no more tumor you know and uh, no additional levels are removed now by removing only uh, tissues uh, where the cancer is known uh, to be present the technique combines a very high cure rate you know uh, with excellent preservation uh, of the normal skin you know and uh, once the that uh, we call uh, um, Uh, you know, the cancer cell, uh, once they are fully removed, you know, the surgeon will determine the type of the repair of the best cosmetic procedure, you know, and, uh, for the best results, you know, and, and the surgeon may refer patients to the another physician uh, for wound closure and uh, for the cosmetic surgery, you know. Now, it is uh, special because uh, the entire edge and the undersurface of the each skin cancer layer is uh, microscopically examined for the presence of the cancer cells. And the traditional surgical pathology techniques uh, uh, uses vertical sections or like uh, bread loafing, you know, uh, and uh, it's only helpful to uh, evaluate 1% uh, or 3% of the tumor margins, you know. Uh, thereby increasing the chances that uh, a small tumor clusters may be missed and left behind you know and uh, you know this technique enables the examination of the hundred percent of the entire tumor's margin and, uh, um, and thereby reducing the chance of uh, recurrence by uh, of the skin cancer you know now uh, this surgery is uh, uh, significantly more labor intensive than uh, conventional methods of treating the skin cancer, you know. And as a result, uh, it's more expensive. And uh, this type of surgery is typically uh, reserved only for the certain situations which include like uh, recurrent cancers that have uh, not been cured by the conventional techniques and large tumors with the distinct margins and the tumors that uh, occur in cosmetically sensitive areas like uh, mid facial tissues and uh, scarring uh, like uh, basal cell uh, cancers you know and uh, and it is uh, this technique is uh, scheduled with the understanding that the patient may be spending the entire day in the office and depending on the number of levels necessary to clear the tumor you know and most of these procedures are performed with the patient in the waiting uh, room, awaiting the verdict from the most surgeon, you know.
Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information about any disease, any medical condition, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more informative videos every day. Thank you.